Sister Madeline, if maybe you have followed me up here, I was hoping maybe we could be alone a little bit just to talk a little more intimately and don't pay attention to Shane. Shane's just, he's one of us and you don't have to be embarrassed about it, but I thought we might take a moment alone to talk. So, um, I th we did so well with the dowsing rods before, so, oh my, okay. Let's talk again just so we can be sure it, what the signal is for yes, okay. Same as before, wonderful, straighten out please. And then show me again what the signal for no is. Okay, beautiful. So put them back together ahead of me again. Um, I just want to make sure, is this Sister Madeline? <laughs> it, it's so really nice to meet you and I have a feeling that I really, really wish that we had met in um, the same time, the same What's the word? Dimension. What is it that you liked about me? Is it, um, I don't know, is it, you know, do I remind you of somebody? No? Wow, okay. Straighten out for me if you would. So while you're doing that, I want you to really watch this later. Um, because it's not all the time, but there's definitely the potential for some orbs kind of mm -hmm. flying into you and away from oh, you. Oh, okay. Oh, wow. And so, it, straighten out for us? If it was dust, I, I would think there'd be more of it. Um, and we call them orbs, Shane, seeing some little bits of energy. Is that you? Is it really? It's very wow. impressive. Wow, so I get to see even more of you. This is really a treat for me. Straighten out for me. So I guess it's kind of a silly question to ask why you like someone. Um, um, do you, okay, I'm just going to get vain here now. Do you like my hair? <laughs> well, thank you, because I'll tell you something, honestly, I'm really insecure about my hair. Um, it's just always been crazy since I've been a little kid, and when I was little, my mom kept it so straight and a little pixie. And so when I got older, I just decided to let it grow wild. And <laughs> she liked that. Okay. Um, so straighten out for me. Um, thank you. You know what? I'd like to know now <clears throat> what you looked like a little bit. Um, did you have brunette hair?
were attracted romantically to women before you went into the convent? Wow. Wow. Well, you know, me too. You know, I had my first girlfriend when I was 13 years old, so. Um, wow. Okay, straighten out for me. Did your parents know that you were attracted to women? didn't know till I was <clears throat> almost 18. Did you have a relationship for the entire time you were in the convent? You did. Wow. Wow. Straighten out for me. I'm going to ask you a really tough question and then I won't ask you too much more. Straighten out for me. We don't understand where you are right now, um, uh, but would I find your grave in Calvary Cemetery? Oh, serious sharp pain in my head. Wow. I, wow. Okay. A straight now for me if you would. Wow. Ask if that was from her. Uh -huh. Ask if that was from her. Yeah, okay. Straighten out for me. Thank you. I just had a really sharp shock through my head. Um, was that you? Was that you causing that? Wow. That's a lot of energy. You must have tremendous energy. You say you can't leave, you can't leave here, correct? Wow. Straighten out for me, please. I'm trying to understand why you're here um, and why you can't leave. Straighten out for me, if you would, please. Straighten out. Um, Do you know why you can't leave? Wow. Well, I'm sorry about that, but maybe we can talk through this a little bit and help you figure it out. Would you like that? We talk about it and try to figure out and try to figure out to help you get out of here. Um, I kind of miss you though, honestly. Um, straighten out. Yeah, straighten out for me. I, I think you know already what this question is going to be. I can actually feel it. Um, did you kiss a woman before you came into the convent? I knew it, yes. I saw that one coming for sure. Straighten out for me. Straighten out. Did you ever hear the phrase particular friends? You did. Okay, because we read that was kind of the, you know, the term used to indicate um, um, lesbians in the convent. Straighten out for me, please. I know, I think you're getting a little bit tired, are you? Straighten out for me. Just a lot of energy. Um, you know what, I, I'm going to pause here for a moment, we're both getting a little tired, um, I, you know, I'm just curious, Shane, did you feel any different energy? I mean, I think this is a particularly female energy in this place. Did, did it feel different than other places, or? That's a good question. I've never tried to gender. Uh -huh. Energy. Uh -huh. I feel like there's a lot of, a lot of energy, a lot of good energy. It feels good though, doesn't it? I yeah. Mean, um, there is a sense of community here. 
there is a sense of white light.